All right, I'm just gonna, I'm comparing motor brake on versus motor brake off. All I wanna know is, all I'm comparing is from the time that I fully turn the throttle off and the time that this actually comes to a complete stop. So right now, motor brake is on, it's programmed on. So let's give it a shot. Let me just reset this timer here. Turn this thing on. Run it at half throttle for a bit. Okay, give it another try. Okay, so let's reprogram speed controller. Turn off the motor brake, give it 30 seconds to reset. Another 15 seconds. All right, turn that to full. Got a beep, go to center. Second beep, go to full. Center. Make a meta hydride off. Turn that off. Go back to center. Break off. Should be here. Turn off the speed controller for 30 seconds. So at this point I reprogram the speed controller for motor brake off. I'm just giving it 30 seconds to reset itself. This is down. Alright, 30 seconds is up. Brake is off. Yeah, it took much longer to stop. See how it keeps spinning? Turn the brake back on. It's my cheat sheet. Give it 30 seconds. Yeah, I'm going to set this to full because I need to program it. We got a beep, go to center. Second beep, go to full. Center. Two beeps. Knuckle metal head right off. Turn that down. Go back to center. Break on is up. Back to center. Actually, if I could, actually, I just need to turn this off. That should be all set. The brake should be on at this point. Give it 30 seconds. So again, the brake is on. Give it another. 12, uh, 10 seconds. All 
All right. Should be good. Reset that. This is a switch I have programmed, so if the blade stopped here, this will hit the ground, and I don't want that to occur. So I have a little thing set up here that it kicks the blade down, which is this thing over here. Let's bring it up to the front. This. So this little thing over here. Put that on the side. You wanna hold that? Hold that right there. No, the wing right here, right where my hand is. Yeah, right there. And then this is my trigger. 